Maka Maka, and welcome back to another day with Davis. My name is Bridget. This is it. This is officially um, the move. As you can see, we're stinking on our way. We're already driving um, our ETA. It's 10 o'clock right now. Yeah, oh yeah, Leo's here with me too. Um, our ETA to get to Oregon because the plan is we're gonna stop in Oregon, um, chill there for a little bit in Portland or near Portland. So yeah, we're off. It's it been a ride of emotions this morning. Um, I had to say goodbye to my parents this morning and then I had to say goodbye to uh, my kids. And then heartbreakingly, there were some kids that I wasn't able to say goodbye to and it really like, it really tore me up. Leo can affirm I've been really, really, really frustrated. Yeah, dude, you've been crying. It's kind of creeping me out. Yeah, but we are on our way now. It's gonna be 10 hours. I've done this drive before, but I mean, there's not really much to it. This vlog is just gonna be really today, um, us just driving. So making little stops, I guess, here and there to go to the bathroom, get some snacks, uh, regas the car, and then tomorrow we are going to take on Portland. Turn left on Ingamara grade, then turn right. My car, she speaks, my car speaks. And there probably won't be much stuff today just because it's just gonna be us driving talking, listening to music, and trying to survive this drive. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's gonna be it. I will keep you guys updated. I hope that you guys are excited. Thank you guys for all the support that you've been giving to me. Um, but yeah. I've been staring at the edge of the water long as I can remember never really knowing why. So we're eating our uh, in and out right now. We made a stop to Ready. eat, prepare ourselves for um, the long drive ahead, the long mountain, and eat some more. Look at that monster style. So good. It's insane. We're gonna get going. Um, nothing has happened. We've just been driving forever. Can you see the bags under my eyes? Look right here. They disgust you. Um, but yeah, so that's what's going on right now. We're gonna get out of here, kind of just stretch our legs a little bit because it's been a long drive and we have like six hours left, so. I wish I could be the perfect daughter, but I come back to the water, no matter how hard I try. Every turn I take, every trail I track, every path I make, every road leads back to the place I know where I cannot go, where I long to be. See the light where the sky needs to see, it calls me. And no one knows how far it is. Guys, I'm freaking tired. Leo's here still. It's, oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Um, we're running out of daylight, it's 6 o'clock, and we still have another 3 hours to go, you probably can't even hear me because my window's up, um, but yeah, I'm super tired, this ride, this drive is hard, I've made this drive before, but it's so much harder this time, Leo's been, we've played a podcast, we've played hundreds of songs, Disney songs and all this stuff, so yeah, just a little update, we did make it to Oregon, we are in Oregon right now, and that's where we're staying tonight, woohoo! Uh, we didn't stop at the sign or anything, but yeah, another three hours. We should be towards the end of Oregon, which is where we're staying tonight. Um, and then tomorrow we'll take on whatever tomorrow holds. But yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update since you've just be see been seeing scenery of what's going on around us. But yeah, so we're still alive. We're still kicking. I might fall asleep at the wheel though, let's get real. But it's so much cooler over here. It was so hot where I was. And it's like, cool. Except when the sun goes in my face and I get kind of angry. But yeah, all right, let's keep going, I guess. Hey, so we made it. We're in the hotel. Look, it's so nice. It's like an actual apartment. We're trying to figure out how to turn on the lights. That was the first day. I know it was super, like, kind of uneventful. But that is because this is a bunch of traveling today. Tomorrow should be the interesting day. We're going to go to Portland tomorrow. Um, 
check out the sites a little bit, go get some Voodoo Donuts, which is something that it has been highly recommended. And then after that, we are gonna get our way on our way to Seattle. It's literally almost 11 o'clock, and we were supposed to get in at seven today. So that's that, but we're gonna chill. So here's uh, till tomorrow, PJ. Later, guys. Good morning, guys. All right, so we slept, we showered, we're ready for the day, and uh, huh? Oh yeah, we did some push-ups. I didn't finish it actually. And if you can see outside, there's no sun. Welcome to Oregon. We are going to go, like, we're just getting ready, all of our stuff together right now. I need to still brush my teeth and do all the stinking um, fragrancing of my life. And then we are going to go out and we are going to go to a Voodoo Donuts place for breakfast, which I'm kind of excited about. Yeah. I need to get a sweatshirt. This isn't my shirt. These is just my pants and my socks because all of my stuff is in my car, packed up. So I'm going to go to my car, get some stuff. We're going to go to Portland right now. We're going to get some donuts for breakfast. And then we are going to just check around because a lot of Portland is really busy right now. And like my mom texted me and said that the like bridges were closed down or something. Like all of them except for like one bridge. You guys are along for the ride, whatever it has in store. So ready, Liam? Ready. Let's do it. Where's Leo? I don't know where he could possibly be. Leo? Underneath the bed, Leo? Leo, where are you? Where are you, Leo? Stop on, boys! It's me! <laughs> In a quarter of a mile. Okay, we made it to Portland. <laughs> Look at it, it's so beautiful. Leo doesn't want to talk to me though because he's embarrassed by me. It's so sad. But we made it, that was literally, let's go. That was literally one of the most stressful things that I've done. I'm not a city driver, so it was really difficult. I've never driven in LA. I've never driven in, um, well, I guess I drove in Seattle. No, I took the bus in Seattle. But yeah, so it was kind of stressful. No, it was super duper stressful. But we made it, we are here, we are going to go to a place called Voodoo Donuts, but I don't think that we're gonna get anything because the stinking line is literally like 200 people long. It's insane, that's the only reason people probably come to Portland. But we're here, we're gonna explore around, the waterfront is that way. You can't see it because buildings are in the way. But we're gonna head over there in a minute um, and just, you know, cruise the area. So it'll be good, there's a lot of people here. Well, not actually as much as I thought there was gonna be, to be honest, but it's gonna be cool. There's a lot of new stuff to check out, so we you guys are gonna come gonna up. up that place. The grocery and deli area? No, the one right Oh, the one, to exotic dancers, that's <laughs> not happening. We're about our Lord and Savior, Jesus. Um, I thought this was a library. It's definitely not a library. I wonder if people are like mad at me because it's like disrespecting their religion. <laughs> uh, even the we made it to Voodoo Donuts, as you can see, the line is atrocious. I think this is just the line to get in, and then this is the line to pick up. I don't 100% know, it's crazy. I might think what I'm doing now, so I feel less uncomfortable about it. Really? But yeah, so we're gonna get donuts for um, us, and then we're gonna head to the ocean, to the waterfront. There's not an ocean here. We should, we should be good. Yeah, Leo's like, it's not gonna go that slow. Leo, this thing is moving slower than molasses on the back of a snail that's been impregnated by a sloth. That's gross. <laughs> All right, we're inside, this place is lit. Look at it. Crazy. And they have regular donuts too, says Leo, but look at this thing in the homie behind me. I'm be just like this guy when I grow up. But it's really cool. There's a lot of stuff here. Except the thinking, I don't think I want to eat an underwear donut. If I'm being 100% honest. Yeah. 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 Okay, so yeah, we're gonna get some donuts. It's gonna be cool, right, Leo? <laughs> Okay, so we got, this guy behind us is gonna give me some uh, music. Don't copyright me, please, YouTube, I beg you, please, just don't do it. So we got our donuts, finally. We waited like an hour. No, we didn't wait an hour. It was like 30 minutes, maybe, to get them. And then, here it is. So, let's see what these things are all about. And what the big hullabaloo is for this freaking long as crap line. Initial reactions. Okay, go ahead. Shine, put it in your mouth. I got this one, too. It's maple and bacon, so is it good? Good or like, like, like freaking, you know what I mean? These are the ones I got. I got 
Voodoo man, look at him, he's like a weird. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try this donut. This donut that which is the bacon and the maple one, let's see. Straight up, it tastes like a pancake. Straight up, just like straight up a pancake with syrup on it. We didn't get milk. We're freaking idiots. That's your fault. That's on you. I found the voodoo place. You're supposed to find the milk. <laughs> Leo's all the way over there. We're at the top. This is crazy cool. You can see literally like the whole city. Well, I might be exaggerating a little bit, but it's so cool up here. Maybe I'll come back one of these days when I have uh, my crew, because there's going to be a crew in Seattle. I'm so excited. I will just come back here and... Uh, Dang, dude, that's a long, freaking fast falling death. But you can see a lot, of dude, it's crazy up here. I'm literally, no, I'm not gonna do it. Yeah, you're gonna have to get to a higher level. But yeah, we're gonna take a picture. It's super cool up here. I just wanna show you kind of the surrounding place. We're gonna take a picture, then we're gonna head out. This is awesome. Oh, guys, that was crazy. Those pictures were fire. Hey, if you, huh? The edge. Oh my god, yeah. If you guys want to see it, shameless plug, go follow me at on Instagram at 21 Patrick Davis. Uh, it's literally the same for everything, but literally, like, oh, those pictures are gonna be so sick. I'm so excited to post them, but uh, yeah, this is that's like the don't look down, Leo. Oh, he makes me nervous because I really think he's gonna die, but anyway, yeah, that's what that's gonna be. We are gonna get out of here, but I just wanted to show you guys, tell you guys, go follow me on 21 Patrick Davis at Instagram. Um, super sick picture is going to be out of there and then we are rolling. <laughs> Leo just starts crawling back. He's like, no more, <laughs> no more. Okay, my phone was about to die so I had this thing connected to my portable charger. So if it's like tugging, I'm sorry. But we made it to Chinatown, see? It's actually called Chinatown. I, uh, it's, there's not much. Um, well, I mean, I guess this is kind of Chinese-ish design. I don't know. because Oh, that, that's pretty cool. Okay, you know, let's just go, Leo. Okay, this way it is. So yeah, so we're just checking it out, seeing the sights. It actually, it, it's a different design. It's more open. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute. Let me take a picture of it. Hey, don't think about it. So yeah, we're just chill, chilling around. I don't know if there's gonna be much to show from here, but um, if something cool happens or we see something awesome, then I will report it. All right, so we officially, Jesus Christ, we made it to the waterfront. This is more terrifying than freaking standing on top of the building. What if there's sharks in that water? Oh, God. I probably shouldn't hold my phone over the freaking crevasse of water like that. Um, but yeah, this is actually, there's a boat over there. Do you see the boat? Where is it? Do you see the boat, Leo? Yeah. Right there? There's a boat. You can't see it because my phone doesn't have very good resolution. But anyway, we're just going to walk around. Maybe we'll go on top of the bridge and maybe I'll push Leo off. Who knows? Who knows what the day holds? But we're just going to explore around a little bit. And then we're gonna get going, um, but it's pretty nice. I this is actually really scary because I don't know what's in this water, and I don't like water as you all know. So, but pretty darn cool, pretty cool. I wonder if I could see anybody swimming. That'd be cool. All right, let's go, Leo. So we went to some marketplace by the waterfront. Pretty cool. There's a lot of a lot of cool stuff, a lot of people. Um, I told Leo to give me his solemn vow that he would not uh, allow me to buy absolutely anything. And he said, uh, you won't buy anything, I'll buy things, but not you. Because I always want to buy like souvenirs for people. But it's pretty cool. I mean, I don't see a whole lot. Some dude was selling swords and wands, which is the, two, on, the only two things that you really need in life. That no freaking working charger. Look at us We could paint a perfect picture About us From your head to toe I fit you They follow us Yeah, we make up thing it's fiction They believe it, so I guess it must be real I can read your mind I know what you're thinking I could spend my time Feeling all the reasons What they know about us doesn't make a difference Baby, we got us We are something different Alright, we are out of here uh, We just got done eating and listening to some pretty cool What, what is that? In, jazz? It was jazz I don't know what it is I don't know, but the, all I know is that chicken hero So good Yeah, Leo had falafel I don't know what it actually is called 
But um, anyway, so we're done with that. Um, we're just walking out of Chinatown, back to my car, and then we're gonna take off. Um, I don't think it's this way. I don't think I'm I'm gonna um, record the drive again today. Uh, one, it's only two hours. Two, uh, well, maybe I'll record it on the way out of Portland. But I mean, there's there's not much. I'm pretty sure you guys got enough freaking scenery from my car yesterday. So we're just gonna get going. So the next time you see us, we will probably be in Seattle. Um, I don't know what else is gonna happen today. This might be it. But if not, or if it is, I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, we made it. Home sweep home, I think. This is the neighborhood that's gonna freaking um, kick me out. So we have to find it. I don't know actually where it is. I know I'm in apartment A, but yeah, this is really weird. I don't know how to feel about it, but I'm gonna get inside, find where it's supposed to be, get inside, kinda try and set up a little bit, and then I'll give you guys an update. This is a weird feeling, guys. It's crazy, but yeah, I'll tell you guys what's going on when I know what's going on. Guys, this is so freaking weird. Oh my gosh. That's my bed for the moment. Um, but this is crazy. Like right now, okay, so um, so yeah, I haven't really talked about much about all of this and um, kind of what it's like to move because to be honest, I haven't um, kind of like accepted it. I haven't thought about it at all or any of it. And even like I'm here right now and it's just like weird that this is where I'm gonna be staying that this is my new home um but we'll see i don't know i'm not sure i know i need to call everybody and tell them that i got here but we made it we made it dude oh yeah dude dude after hours of driving that freaking drive is crazy and um a lot of traffic a lot of scares a lot of stops a lot of obstacles but we made it here um so for right now thank you leo for right now i think i'm just gonna sign off for the night or until something maybe amazing happens tonight just to kind of get a feel for this and to find out uh what it's all about you know me and leo i think are gonna go maybe walk around i don't even know if we yeah why not maybe we'll walk around just check out the area but yeah that's gonna do it for us tonight i think dude we should go out to oh wait sunday yeah well actually probably not because i want you to meet uh george and everybody who i'm gonna be staying with but uh it's weird. I don't George even. Be here tonight? To be honest, yeah, George's gonna be here soon. Well, soon is relative, but um, I don't even know what I'm feeling right now, so I can't convey it to you guys. But say la vie. Let us begin the initiation of this room becoming my room. When do we get my stuff for me? Let's go. Okay, go ahead. I'm not dog. Look, I found my friend Matthew. Matthew, hi. I'm here. Wait, why are you still Come here? Okay. Look at Matthew. He's so nice. Oh man. Today. Just kidding. This is Logan, say hello. Hello, Logan. This is not. This is the Logan that. This is the say Logan that. Oh, he actually. Yeah. Does he like being recorded? Yeah, he likes being himself. Oh my gosh. So yeah, um, this is Matthew. I'm pretty sure I've talked to him about. I've played uh, games with his brother and everything. Um, so yeah, that's is. We ran into him. He actually lives. I know so many people here. There's uh, Mary and Nisha. Nisha's on the floor. Say hi, Nisha. <laughs> We're signing Mary. So yeah. We are going to head to Sambika, which is a place that I have worked at before with him and with her and with all of us. All, all of yeah, us. basically yeah. everyone except Leo. Leo's just here for the ride. Yup. This is so freaking weird. Um, literally, this place right here, hi Matthew. This place is where you can't even see it really. Oh but, my gosh, be good all day. Dude, I worked here for two summers. Staff cabin. First year, I was hey, a newbie. Hey, Second year. Hi guys. Um, I guarantee you because like, I was like an OG. Me and Matthew were OG people here. So I don't think anyone really knows me, except freaking Katie. <laughs> Hi Katie, how you doing? Oh yeah, Marcus is here too. He's doing the tab. They're watching Game of Thrones. Oh, oh my gosh. Hi, how's it going? Yeah, this is Katie. Katie is like OG from Los Banos, just like me and Matthew. This is so freaking weird. Press the button. This to control, yes, this is a vlog. This is my boy Gerald, what's good? This is my boy Gibby, he's new. We're working on our relationship. It's a work in progress, but it's working. So look at Misha again, too. And then Adam. We're cool, but apparently not friends. Yeah, what the heck? Alright, you guys. This is the end of today. We all shut up. But I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm super tired. Um, I'm going to watch some stuff, eat, and then tomorrow we are going to go to Seattle.
And hopefully the Oilers can get by them. <laughs> and they got so yeah, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm trying to go to bed. Um, but yeah, until tomorrow, guys. Seattle trip, hopefully. Actually, it might not be the Seattle trip tomorrow. We'll see. But anyway, good night. See you guys tomorrow. How are these games? Good morning, Vietnam! Vietnam. Okay, so we're up um, right now. Oh gosh, it's awful that one. I don't know what's going to happen today. There's some stuff that's going on in Seattle, um, so I'm not sure when we're going to go there, if we're going to go there. It's super kind of, it's not cloudy right now here. It's actually pretty sunny, which I might kind of want to go walk around, but we're going to go try and do gym hopping or see if there's a gym that we can get at, get to for a little bit for free, work out a little bit, and then we are going to go figure out what's going on with the rest of the day. I still have like all of my stuff that's still all around. Um, last night I slept. Kinda. It was alright. Leo slept on the floor, even though he was offered to matches. I don't understand why. But, I don't know. He's a caveman, but... That's what we're gonna go do right now, so let's... Oh, go! Question, please. I didn't, but can you just say I asked me what you asked me? Is that supposed to be a Pokemon on your sweater? Is it a Pokemon on my sweater? No, Leo, it's called being a maverick. You wouldn't know about it, okay? What kind of mother after that would wear a Pokemon on their sweater? No. So we're gonna we're going to Target. We have to get some milk. We got done with the workout. It was stinking hard. I broke my tripod, so I have to go in here and try and find another one as well. But yeah, we're just gonna go get some essentials from the target i don't know if you can see it see target and then we're gonna go home shower and then explore okay we're done i'm actually excited this was actually a good little trip one i adulted look oh, don't warm it with your loins i got milk this is my first adult purchase ever don't warm it um also i got another tripod so this was my other tripod it, it as you can see on the top it broke off and that was where like i would attach the thing to it and this is my new tripod look at the distinct difference in size can you see it's freaking this is a real tripod this one's one for cameras that actual like people who vlog use this is just a cheapo depot one from like amazon so i'm excited about using this for my uh, new stuff um i got a new freaking um uh, charger. I'm actually really excited about that. The colors are hecka tight. But yeah, so we're gonna head home right now. Um, shower, chill out for a little bit, and then later on we're gonna go to explore around, explore around my area, get to know it a little bit because I, I literally have no idea where I'm going ever. And then I don't think we're going to Seattle today. Is that fair to say? No, probably not. Because of like there's protesting going on and stuff, and we just don't kind of want to get involved with all that. We kind of want to go in it safe. Um, which sucks. Well, well, maybe we will. I don't know. I, I'm going on the fact that I don't think we're going to go today. Leo, I might want to take him just because he's never been to Washington, but we went to Portland yesterday. So we'll see. Um, and so it's just, it's just a bunch of stuff, but you guys will be along for the ride and here we go home. I'm uh, trying something. Me, oh, by the way, me and Leo are going to go get some food and then just chill out, uh, watch a movie and then go explore around. We haven't done that yet, but I'm trying something. You guys know I don't try anything ever unless like it's offered to me by Maya but tell them what's called I'm what is it called gyoza it's called gyoza um so we'll see i don't like it smells good is that enough? Mm -mm. 
No? That's why I only try food what that Mai gives me. Because she knows what's good and what's not. It's tasty as fuck, man. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go get my food now, which is of course the most American food you can think of. Same food we had last night. And then we're gonna bounce. Um, we're not going to Seattle today. Um, and But we are gonna go for a walk, exploring kind of my area over by my house. Like I've been freaking insane all day, but we still haven't done it. But now I'm dressed and I'm ready. I need to put on longer socks. But then once we're done eating and we're done like we're chilling, watching a movie and Max and relaxing, then we'll go um, check out what's around there. Hopefully, and there's some, it's, some, it's a pretty nice area. But yeah. yeah, so we're gonna get going to go get my food. So me and Leo are out just strolling, enjoying the nature. This place is really cool and literally, I think, are you serious? Like literally, we're not even like seven minutes away maybe walking from my apartment and right there, you guys can't see it because my phone isn't that good, but we can see the outline of Seattle. That's crazy. I wanna take- uh, Maybe it's Bellevue, look. Maybe it's Bellevue, that's a good, okay. yeah. Cause look, boom, 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 but then Seattle is right there. I don't know. It's, it's crazy though, if that is Seattle, this is a really like beautiful area. Like I'm just saying, I'm already, I'm already like living in a super nice area, but I mean, I wouldn't mind living this, a, dude. Okay, yeah, we gotta take a picture on this road. But uh, yeah, so we're just chilling and enjoying the sunshine in um, Washington. I can't say Washington, California, because there's no such thing in Washington, California. There is crazy. There's Seattle. And then there's Leo's big head. It's straight up Seattle. We can see the Space Needle from here. Oh my gosh. Man, Leo, I'm glad you came with me, man. It's so sick. It is stinking awesome. Birthday, birthday, birthday. What's that for? Oh, James. Yeah. I remember uh, that dude with the red hair. They always say, uh, Crouching Tiger picks up rock! And that was a huge <laughs> attack, remember? Sunset Lane. At the funeral, Sunset though. Hills. The most beautiful area, and I I'm, don't feel like it's a good place to go take a picture. I mean, I do feel like it's a good place to take a picture. But just for respect reasons, it's probably not the best. We made it, and this place, whoa, this is pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Dude, look at this. This is awesome. Dude, we could come out here and stink and like, swim. Well, maybe not swim. Look at all the lily pads. These are like legit straight up lily pads. I've never seen lily pads in my life. Oh, that's so cool. I wish you guys could see it in like full detail. But this is crazy. There's someone out there canoeing. Do you see them? All the way out there. Tickle, tickle. Wait, tickle, tickle, tickle. This is crazy. Look, Leo's looking very majestic. So sick. Dude. Oh, fishing permitted. This is so cool, guys. That water doesn't look the cleanest, but this is still super cool. Look at this place. Could you imagine if we stinking lived on this, dude? Like right over there? Or like right there. Yeah. We found the lake. We're going to take some pictures. Yeah. <laughs> Literally just said the same thing. And um, then we're gonna get out of here. I mean, what, is this like a mile, you think? Mile and a half? Maybe, maybe like a mile. Like a mile it took us to get here from my house. So we are here and we are going to do great things. And one of which is not gonna be jump into this water. So be sure to follow me on 21 Petra Doe's. <laughs> Send me your location, let's focus on community. For those of you guys who don't know, when I was a kid, I was a bookworm. I loved books. I loved libraries. The feel of them just going in and being able to read in silence and just have that time was amazing. And in San Jose, there was a library I always went to, and then I moved at like nine years old, and I stopped going. So that was really hard for me, but this, but let's check this out, dude. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at this. I know it's just a hallway, but like with the sun in the background and everything, it's just, oh, ah, so nice. You don't even understand. What is this? This is like a little shopping center. What the heck? I mean, this ain't freaking keep me out of anything. Back up, Pete. Back up if you just want to get swapped. Just like Jake Paul. Wow. 
stop it. No waffles for you. That's crazy. This is a really nice place. <laughs> Go away now, kitty. It's time to stop following. I love you, but you need to stay. Please leave. Kitty, shoo. You're fat. Oh, there we go. That was the insult it needed. <laughs> okay, guys, that is going to do it for me. You want to say something special? No, I just said that you're hiding me. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I'm going to do something special uh, later on. Maybe on the day that you take off, we'll record it. But Did I yeah, take off? With, no, that. Yeah, if you take a day off. From work? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to do something special uh, for you guys. <laughs> What's the matter with you? Leo hasn't been drinking, but he basically is like this all the time. Is that the Makamakan you talk to? Huh? Is that the Makamakan you talk to? These are the dudes, yeah. I like Makamakan. That proves that I watch your videos. Thank you. <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna end it here. Um, we went on our hike and then we ended up going to the gym again and just hanging out a little bit. So I'm super tired. I have to take this guy to the airport tomorrow and then when I take him to the airport, that will be the end of the vlog. Um, it was a good day today, good day of exploring. Oh, you can get some of those pictures. I will. But um, yeah, so that's gonna do it. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, dudes. Um, so, well, as you can see, we're taking Leo home. It's time for him to go bye-bye on the big plane. So we're not in a rush. It's kind of because of me that we're a little late because I stay in bed forever, but it's 10.30 right now. I'm taking him to the airport and then I'm gonna come back and that's gonna be the end of the vlog. So I guess let's make our way to the airport. All right, guys. I mean, that's it. Um, I just, I dropped Leo off at the airport. Um, he made it on, well, I actually don't know. I'm, I'm gonna wait for a text from him, but <clears throat> he made it to the flight. Leo's going back to Cali and I'm here. My roommates are gone, off to work right now. Um, so I guess this is it. This is it for the vlog. Um, this has been an insane adventure. Uh, just getting up here driving all those hours if you ever do the drive to stinking seattle or portland or anywhere out of state it's insane definitely don't try and do it in one day i mean this is home i i haven't really talked about my feelings towards the move yet i don't think because i don't really know my feelings towards it um for the longest time i've been kind of suppressing all of the like feelings and feelings of anxiety and stress but also feelings of excitement. I've been kind of suppressing and keeping it inside me because I know that I'm a very passionate person. So when I like let go of uh, my fear, once I let go of my love or whatever, like it'll just get overwhelmingly um, intense. So whatever it is, especially with this, because I know that this is an extremely stressful uh, situation and it can be really painful just because of the stuff that I've said, leaving everybody, I've kept it inside. And I've kept it inside so much that it's actually happening now and it's actually, I'm here. And it's, I just, I don't know what I feel about it. There are some good things, obviously. This isn't a bad thing, this is a good thing. Um, it's just, it's, it's, it's just new. It's all new. Um, and it's just gonna take some getting used to. But, I definitely, I know I mess around and talk a lot with Liam and everything, but I would not have been able to do this without him. I'm, I'm very thankful that he came to me because it would have been a lot, a lot, a lot more um, negative if he wasn't here. I would have just been festering in my um, sadness and not exploring the area and not um, taking advantages of the excitement and the good things that come with this. Um, I'm just letting you guys know, I'm going to say I do not live in Seattle. I live nine miles away from Seattle, but... Um, I'm just gonna say I live in Seattle because <laughs> I basically am there, but yeah, I just want to let you guys know that for the vlog But that's it um, I'm here. I made the move and you guys did it with me You guys came along on that long car ride with me. You guys went to Portland with me uh, the other day you went exploring with us over to the, all the, the little different lakes and on the nature trail And we did it. We did it. You guys are here and it's insane 
So I just want to thank you guys for all the support that you guys have been giving me um, in these last few months and just the support that you guys give me in general. <sighs> it's, I, I'm really thankful. So thank you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed the trip. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my channel and all of the crazy stuff that comes with it. But oh, most importantly, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a like if you're not already. Please do subscribe. And I will see all of you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>